Okay, so here's some people you should know. We'll start with these two. Hi, I'm Ben Viss. I'm Meredith. They are the creators of Hill Country Samaritans. And a few years back, they had an idea, a back to school bash aimed at getting school supplies to kids. But that wasn't all. Games, crafts, a celebration. So when kids come, they were getting supplied for the school year, but they also would be celebrating. They'd be feeling the whole community surround them and love on them and get them all geared up and excited for a new school year. So in 2019, they teamed up with the other two people in this picture, Bill and Kelly Beadle, and gave it a shot. They figured they'd keep it small, but that would quickly change. It was originally just going to be for Lake Hills. We were thinking of doing a bit more of a Lake Hills based bash of about 300 people we were planning on servicing. Um, the superintendent then said, it sounds like you've got a good idea going. Why don't you just take the entire Bandair ISD? And we said, okay, that seems like it's a bit more, but if that's the picture that, that's happening, then we can, we can go with that. But it takes more than a can-do attitude to pull something that big off. You also need money, more money than Ben and Meredith could come up with on their own. So they took a chance and applied for a grant with the BEC Foundation. And the BEC Foundation came through with a $2,500 grant helping them to get the first ever Hill Country Samaritans back to school bash up and running. It would be very easy to write off a couple of people who are just coming in with this grandiose idea. I sure. have never had a chance to, to show what we could do and BEC just was there from the very beginning before we had a chance to even prove anything. In 2020, the year of the pandemic, BEC was there again, this time with the $5,000 grant. The funding uh, was difficult because of everybody was going through difficult times and BEC was there to help us get through that. This year they expect the biggest one yet with nearly 1,000 students. And once again, the BEC Foundation will be their much needed helping hand, something Ben and Meredith will forever be thankful for. And BEC for them to come through again is just yeah. showing their faithfulness to us and to um, our vision for those students.